possess a different type of focus. Punish an opponent like this. Lights up his chest with a chop. Knocked him right off his feet. Yeah, no kidding. Ooh! That strike hit the spot. There's no way he could have avoided that blow. Executed perfectly. What does The Miz have to do at this point to stay in this match? Guys, this is where we find out what he's made of. This is one of the more evenly matched contests we've oh, seen wow. in quite some time. From the looks of things, it could really go either way. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. What does Buzz have in store? We're, We're about to find out. He's inflicting some serious pain here. So impressive. What does Buzz have in store? We're, We're about to find out. Oh, he's going to do it. He goes down hard. We may very well be seeing the finisher here very shortly, guys. And when that happens, you can bet this one's going to be over. Nice job by the... He goes for the cover. And he breaks the cover. Clearly not enough damage done. I'm with Corey. I suspect the finisher is on the horizon and... Given how impactful that move has been as of late, I'd say there's almost no coming back from it. You're right, Michael. It seems like that finisher has become more and more impactful with each passing week, if that's even possible. He's bringing it back inside the ring now. This is a level of destruction no one was expecting. Oh, I think this man needs business. He's on his heels. This may very well be one of his toughest challenges in a very long time. This match is trending in a bad direction for him right now, guys. He's going to want to make some... Snap DDT! The Miz is going to clinch it right here. Can't waste... He's going for the pin. He hasn't done nearly enough to get the pin yet. How in the world... Just go for the finisher already. I don't understand the delay. The odd look at this. Miz. Oh, Buzz just barely got out of the way. He's not in a good spot here, guys. He simply needs to find a way to regroup. So painful. The Miz getting outclassed here tonight, guys. Back now inside the ring. What does Buzz have in store? We're, We're about to find out. Oh, he's going to do it. Carpenter Pele kick. Oh, my. This one is over. The Miz got the worst end of that stick. What does Buzz have in store? We're, We're about to find out. Oh, he's run off the buses. This one's over. That has got to be it. Unreal performance. Hard to imagine, but that match was even better than advertised. Here's another look at that history-making encounter. I can watch highlights of that one all night long. One of the great WWE matches I've ever been able to watch. Here is your winner, Jacob Cassidy. And there's your winner via pinfall. That was simply a case of one guy determined to...
When I competed in the Elimination Chamber, it was one of the most brutal matches of my career. And you won't exactly have any allies out there. Do you know what they say about long shots? I've got no clue. I was hoping you knew. Hey, just give them bloody hell. Now don't go anywhere. We have a classic coming up. We have Bret Hart versus a formidable opponent. You don't want to miss it. Singles action is underway, and in this one, I wouldn't attempt to predict what's going Ouch. to happen. I'd just be ready for anything. Sometimes that's all you can do. If you haven't hit record yet, now might be a good time to do that. These guys are going to have a match you'll want to watch over and over again. Drop down, leapfrog. Nice. He connects with a bulldog. The shoulders are down. For a kick out. He isn't going to go away that easy. Nice move. Brutal forearm. Here's Bret Hart on the defensive. I fully expect him to bounce back, though. This is the type of one on one atmosphere where he thrives. He hits it. Buzz brings everyone to their feet. Got every ounce of that one. This could be over. Come on, Bret Hart, you can do this. Everyone knows that Bret Hart grew up in the famous Hart family, and his father, Stu, was a legendary grappler and promoter for Stampede Wrestling in Calgary, Alberta, Canada. What many people don't know is outside of sports entertainment, the hitman developed quite the resume. What does Buzz have in store? We're, We're about to find out. Oh, he's going to do it. Bret Hart and the Hart family will always be revered in sports entertainment. Hart Hill Pele kick. Oh, my. And the off. His shoulders are down. It's going to take a lot more than that to keep him down. The Hitman staying alive in this match. So resilient. Forearm right to the jaw. Right across the face. That shot hit the opponent exactly in the right spot. What accuracy. Looking for an opening for that finisher, it seems. And that's a smart move. Just hit the finisher, get the win, and get out of there. Getting his attention with a vicious strike. Diving into his bag of acrobatic tricks. Anytime a superstar sees an opening for their finisher, they got to take it, as Byron was saying. 
Elongating the match not only gives your opponent an opportunity to get back in it, but you're also running the risk of injury anytime you're in the ring longer than you have to be. Yeah, but sometimes you just enjoy beating somebody up, especially if you're in the ring with somebody like Saxton. Oh boy, he is rolling. So quick. Check out Bret Hart's offense. He's on the defensive here. Don't be surprised if he shrugs it off and comes back more motivated than ever. Well, he had to expect to take some punishment tonight. You don't step in the ring with this guy and walk away completely unscathed. Well, he had to expect to take some punishment here, right? I mean, it'd be crazy for him to think he was going to walk away from this match completely unscathed. Bret Hart's known as the excellence of execution, and that says it all right there. This man has an unmatched ring awareness and as smooth as silk as he picks his opponents apart. Oh, Corey, he unloaded there. What does Buzz have in store? We're, We're about to find out. Oh, he's going to do it. Bret Hart's rivalries with the likes of Shawn Michaels. Oh, he'll pay kick oh my that's how you put an exclamation point on the end of a match guy i wouldn't have been surprised if that was it wow yeah and the hard bloodline is strong and resilient and never gives up he got him good there you got to think about using the finisher here pretty soon, I would think. Just pick up the win and move on. There's no need to keep this thing going longer than necessary. Oh, Buzz just barely got out of the way. Oh, Buzz just barely got out of the way. Good point by Byron earlier. If there's an opening to execute the finisher, you got to take it. The last thing you want to do is let your opponent hang around for no reason. I can tell you, bad things happen when you do that. If you don't believe me, just go back and watch Skip versus Barry Kurowitz from 1995. I remember that like it was yesterday, Cole. Instead of putting Horowitz away, Skip thought it would be a good idea to do some mid-ring push-ups. And as you were saying, the decision ultimately came back to Hunter. Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. Keep your eye on this one. You know, these guys are giving it absolutely everything they do. Look at this. He hits it. Buzz brings everyone to their feet. We might be looking at a rare hitman loss here, guys. Bret Hart's just getting overwhelmed. Got to figure something out. What does Buzz have in store? We're, We're about to find out. He's going to do it. Oh, the Pele kick. Oh, my. But he's running on a few. There's a pin now. This singles contest has a victor. That match might go down as one of the best matches in WWE history. That was just one of those matches that the men involved should just be proud to be a part of. A legendary performance. Here is your winner, Jacob Cassidy. And there's your winner, ladies and gentlemen. Wow, when you pick up a pinfall victory over somebody like that, you've done something right.